Man, it's only been three days since I shaved, and I grew a little bit of my stubble back. I look a little bit better, in my opinion, but we're not here for that. We're here for some packs. Because I ran to the dollar store, grabbed like 10 packs, because I figured what's 10 bucks, honestly, if, with the more expensive shit. I've gotten basically nothing, so why not just buy some dollar store packs and uh, see uh, what we get. Oh, I must see this. Because opening packs without damaging the cards inside is a lot easier with scissors, believe it or not. Alright, so we got three cards to a pack. Let's see if we get anything out of any of these. And if we don't, at least we're only out ten bucks as opposed to forty. Plus it's a lot different opening the packs as opposed to actually getting a card out. There's our soul. Oh, there's not like code still codes for the online thing. Whatever. Alright. Oh. Why did I whatever, I'll grab the thumbnail image after the first pack because obviously I already fucked that up. Alright. Alright. Let's get a caribou? No, Fomantis. And a random energy. Garbage. Now we will get the reaction. Or the thumbnail. Yeah, I just realized I'm gonna fucking open all the packs after I got my thumbnail, stack all of them up. No, no, that's that's lame. That's lame. To stack them all up and then pull them up one after the other kind of ruins the surprise, doesn't it? I mean, maybe not, but. I should do a stream where I just go through all my old video cards once I actually get them out of the closet. So I try and find my fucking color dusters so I can do that at some point. And we've got a meal, a dew putter, and a tour cat. Might be a Pokemon fan, but there are very few cards I'd probably keep for myself. Since I don't actually play the TCG, I'd keep them mostly as collectibles. So, you know, if I were kind of like a hollow Blaziken, obviously, I'd probably keep that. Maybe like Dunsparce and shit too. Since I really do like some of those derpy mons, but. How is that where to find like a really cool hollow something or another? More than likely it would, you know, be a Blaziken as opposed to. A double sparse, we got Dratini, we got Spurl, we got it in it. Oh shit, Mr. President, what's up? Well, yes. Depending on how all the bullshit goes, former president. But I'm, I'm, not, I'm not here to talk politics. Uh, let me on the go back. I guess the young goose says Donald Trump meme was around before he was even president, so. Well, it's not young goose that it's his ugly man, whatever. Gumshoes, yeah, that. What a really stupid name for a Pokemon for the record. Like, oh man, what's the... What, what, what Pokemon did you end up getting recently? It's like, oh, you know, Gumshoes. That's a good 
probably picked that off my no, I mean the Pokemon. Like, oh. Not a bad joke, that was probably a bad joke. You know, we got Snubble. Ooh, we got us a hollow of uh young goose. Oh shit, it was young goose. Yeah. And we got us a dust ball. Yeah, I tried pulling a hollow, even if it's only two bucks, is still more than the packs work, so Yeah, I'm not helping us on Moon, though, where these packs are from. I will admit, all the starters are actually kind of cool in their own way. I know people give them shit, but, I mean, look, look at Poplio. It's just a dog, you know, fucking seal, or, well, not a seal, but a literal clown dog. But, come on, how can you not love it? Uh, ooh, what's that? A Sharpedo, an actual hollow Sharpedo. Ooh, nice. And the last thing is just an energy. So that part is that Sharpedo is probably worth a little bit more than the uh, Young Goose. Even though young, the Young Goose is full art. Well, not full art, but one of those cooler kind of hollows where it's all over the cards. <sighs> So if there is a cool card, it's in the middle. Which means I actually got the wrong way. Charger bug. Well, all that? No, Cosmo. Is that Cosmo? There's a Cosmo. And a Rider Roll. I'm surprised Cosmo is a applicable as a common card because it is kind of sort of a legendary Pokemon since. I can't breed it. There's only one, and it evolves into legendary Pokemon. Which I'm pretty sure that's the first occurrence of something evolving into a legendary Pokemon. At least before Poipole was released in Ultra Sun. Ooh, Ooh Sandigast, and a Beware. Beware of what? These fucking hands. Right, last pack, pack number 10. Can we pull something really cool? That's the question. If not, I might go back in a few days and, you know, grab a few more. Polyworld, Marini, and a hollow Marini. Okay. Well, not too disappointed, I guess. I know a young goose and the Marini are probably not much, but a Sharpedo could be something. I'll find that out. I'll obviously buy some more packs because. I might just be planning on uh, buying two or three of the new set as soon as it's released. So just look forward to that on if I do decide to end up doing that, if they're actually worth anything. And if they're not, I'll buy some Hidden Fate or something. We'll see. But if you want to see more pack openings, I do much appreciate any subscribers to here and or the YouTube chat or and or the Twitch channel. Following on Twitch is also extremely helpful, especially if you drop in, chat, hang out, do whatever with whatever I'm doing, because, I mean, I'm around pretty much daily, even if the past, even if since the beginning of 2021 has been all the nighttime streams, I'm still around daily until I decide otherwise. So, that said, it's been the Blaze Gang signing out. Ta-ta for now. Peace.